every information that you directly or indirectly give on the internet like your email address the post you like your tweets your phone number these all are examples of data points and with these little bits of information you can be tracked on the internet most of the people use a vpn while browsing thinking their identity will be safe online if you think you are anonymous and your identity is not revealed online by using a vpn or a private browsing mode then you are absolutely wrong they may be a part of your privacy but they are not the whole thing VPNs or virtual private networks are built in a way to secure your data by sending your data through an encrypted tunnel and give you a different IP address so that your real IP address is not revealed but still your real IP address is known to the VPN service providers and VPN service provider can still see what the internet service provider can see in fact in mobile devices it's completely useless to use a VPN because you are often connected to your cellular networks or gps which can easily track your location modern tracking methods collect very specific information about you so that it becomes easier to track you browser fingerprinting is an accurate way to track you from millions of users on the internet almost all the websites you visit daily contains trackers to track your online activity and collect information about your preferences your likes and so on Whenever you visit a website when a tracker first encounters you then the tracker will assign a unique ID to your system which is indirectly you based on your screen resolution what plugins you use your time zone system fonts information about your cookies the device you use and specific information like this so that it can recognize you further and collect more and more information about you let's suppose you visit a website for looking something and after some time you see the same product as an advertisement Here the tracker is able to recognize you that you are the same person who visited a website few minutes ago looking for that product. Unfortunately, it doesn't stop here. Most of the ad trackers collect users information not only to serve ads but also collects more sensitive information about you so that these websites can sell your data to data brokers. 200 billion dollar industry based on selling your personal information to companies that you never heard of. If you want to know how unique you are on the internet based on your browser go to panopticlick.com or amiunique.com and test your browser The whole point of anonymity is to look like the rest of the people on the internet The more plugins you use the more unique features you add to your browser the more you stand out of the crowd and it becomes easier for the trackers to track you on the internet The way VPNs are marketed is not what they are providing you like the complete anonymity by just using a VPN it's totally impossible to stay anonymous by simply using a VPN because the technology with which they are built are not going to give you complete anonymity even if some VPNs are providing multiple hops which are multiple servers that data go through before visiting a website but all of these servers are still maintained by the same VPN service provider so there is no point of increasing the number of hops if the VPN service server is compromised all the data about you is revealed almost all vpns accept the centralized payment methods which is going to directly reveal your identity but apart from privacy vpns are useful for those who want to access region blocked content and for those using public wifi or accessing blocked websites because it makes harder for them to track you but using a vpn with the expectation of complete anonymity is not going to work Using tools like cookie auto delete and no script will stop trackers from tracking you while using no script it automatically blocks javascript from every website but in some websites you need to enable javascript in order to access the content then you can manually change the settings for that website and enable javascript by blocking javascript with tools like no script websites cannot able to gain the information like your browser configuration and your screen resolution etc on january 9 2020 Firefox released an update with the feature of browser fingerprinting protection and by default Firefox blocks the browser fingerprinting trackers Tor network is anonymous because the hops or the servers that our data go through before visiting a website are not provided by the same provider and are provided by the volunteers across the world and none of them know the full length of the traffic Tor has three layer protection and is designed in a certain way to give all of its users the same identity but if you want to use tor network to log into your social media accounts 
then you are using this tool wrong it's not going to make you anonymous if you are giving your own credentials by yourself within the tor network thank you for watching if you like this video make sure you hit that like button and subscribe for more content